Good day everyone. Yeah, it's um, it been a while since I've done a video. It was last week. Um, unfortunately, I won't be doing a, a Friday's funny video this week. Um, just simply because I haven't got anything organised for that. I've just been really crook this week, to be honest. Um, I've just been hit with a dose of uh, gastro, so I'm still trying to get over that. I'm just really lethargic and dehydrated so I'm just trying to build my energy back up from that um, hopefully I'll be fine to go back to work tomorrow but then I've got a few days off and then um, for the weekend and then um, hopefully in another four weeks I'll be off for two weeks holiday so hopefully I can get myself back on track um, yeah, so the other thing that's been going on, uh, I have been uh, having a bit of an issue with my car lately. Um, just this, this bloody um, sensor in it uh, just keeps triggering off on and off, on and off all the time. So i um, gone to the mechanics and that. And this is the ridiculous part, right? Look, I understand that they're going to make a living for, for fixing your car. The part I need is going to cost me around a hundred dollars or more, but then it's like two two hundred odd on top of that just for them to put the part in, and it's a simple unbolt it, take it off, bolt in the new one, clip it in, and it's finished. People are always saying to me, "You really shouldn't be doing repairs on your own car." I don't know why I shouldn't be. See, I like to be a more of a hands-on person. If something goes wrong with my car, I like to find the problem. I like to fix the problem. If it's simple enough for me to do, like this part is. My problem is, I watch a lot of YouTube channels in car repairs. I watch a lot of Mighty Car Mods. I watch Eric the Car Guy. And there's a bunch of others there that like to mess around the cars and stuff. And they teach you how to fix this stuff. The reason why I like to fix stuff on my car and other things is to save me money because the part itself isn't expensive. Some of it is, but it's more of the labour part of it. And yeah, I just like to, to get my hands dirty and, and fix it myself and, and have the satisfaction in myself that I fixed it. I was able to do that. I don't know, is there anybody out there who has the same mindset as me? Like, you'd rather get out there and fix it yourself? Um, yeah, it'd be great to know. <laughs> I'm not the only one that likes to get my hands dirty and fix it myself. Um, I'm still trying to fix the part, by the way. Um, an auto shop I go to doesn't even have the part. They've got the auto number, but they don't have the part. So I'm still trying to chase that part up. <laughs> But anyway guys, um, yeah, it's just a quick video just to tell you all that stuff and hopefully I'll be back on my feet and um, yeah, I've just got some videos to catch up on and that and um, yeah, hopefully we can get back in on track with stuff because I know um, we're going to get into winter, well today is the last day of autumn and we're into winter as of tomorrow so <laughs> starting to rug up already. Anyway guys, uh, that's it. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time.